awareness page. They do not have all of her videos. That was, CC awareness was not, uh, didn't come in until probably six to eight months after, uh, my initial contact with Crystal. And for those of you that don't know, okay, um, she actually got me for $150. And what she did was in that live, <clears throat> she had come out and said that, oh my gosh, I mean, she had the full-blown crocodile tears, the whole nine yards, um, that her son got burned by a fryer that he had pulled down from the shelf and he got covered with hot oil. They took him to the hospital. His burns were too bad. So they life lighted him or airlifted him to a children's burn center in Tennessee. So I was like, oh my God, like that, that's, that was so fucking horrible to me. And you know, she's crying because she didn't have any money for gas to be able to get there. They wouldn't let her go on the helicopter. Um, so I was like, you know what, this, this is like, I can help this person. And you guys know how I am. Um, so I reached out to her. She had given me a phone number. By the way, that phone number has since been disconnected and is no longer in service. Go figure. <laughs> um, but she got the phone number or gave me the phone number. I called her and she was like, well, I'm here in Kentucky and like she had to go to, um, it wasn't, uh, Nashville is where she was telling people. So I'm like, okay, fine. Um, like, what do you drive? I asked her what she drove. I gave her enough money to make it all the way from Jackson out to, um, uh, Nashville and back. Okay. That was, it worked out to like $150. Later that evening, she reached back out to me and she's like, the hospital says they can't put us up here until tomorrow. Could you wire me money so I can get a hotel room? I told her that I would go ahead and get the hotel room for her. And she had put somebody else on the phone. They said that they worked at the hotel and that they did, they wouldn't allow me to do a transaction over the phone. Uh, and they suggested Western Union again, and I fell for it a second time. Um, I asked them how much the hotel room was. They gave me an oddball number, which was actually smart because, you know, I asked them what the total was going to be. And they said it was going to be like $62 and change. So I sent like $70 via Western Union. And... I was like, oh my God, I really, really hope that your baby's fine. Literally, the next day, she is on a freaking live again. And not a not one peep about this kid that just got burned so badly that she was so fucking worried about. And that's when I started looking into her. Well, let me tell you something, okay? When I found out that she doesn't even have custody of her kids... That is when I declared war. Okay. I absolutely declared war on her. And it is not over. It is definitely not over. Um, the only thing that we can do is stay vigilant. Make sure that everybody knows about her. You know, she can delete as many haters as she wants. If you're still able to go on to her lives, post the CC awareness page so that people know what to look for. I do know that there's a lot of people that are on her page uh, that are there to troll her. Um, but like I said, uh, according to um, Daryl this mor um, Daryl Harold this morning, um, she really, really, really has to fuck up for us to be able to get her pinched. Um, all these little things, yes, they're adding up. But we need one time, just one time for her to fuck up like she did with me, okay?